<laughs> All right, you four, let's rest for just a moment. And as soon as we have gathered up our strength, look at how they come to my side as their mother, looking for shelter and hoping for food, no doubt. Let's go ahead and set back off into the winter wilderness, where we are resuming our journey as a mother lynx here in Shelter 2, my friends, where we are doing our best to raise our babies to juveniles who will be able to face the challenges of the world with hopefully all of the strength that their aha, their little bodies can possess. And we are currently working on trying to guide our way through winter. And speaking of winter, look at how much harder it is to see the hairs that have changed their coat color to white versus the hairs that have changed their coat color to brown. Whereas earlier, when it was spring and summer, it was very, very difficult to be able to see the brown hairs. And now it is very easy. We'll feed these two real quick. Now it's very easy to see them, but it's really hard to see the white hairs. And that is exactly why the white hairs will actually change the color of their fur. It will be triggered by a shift in daylight and a shift in temperature. Is there something over there that we can hunt for you? Hang in there, children. I will feed you to the best of my abilities, I promise. And that is actually exactly why the hairs will change color in the winter. That camouflage is essential for them not to stand out to curious and hungry questing eyes like mine and end up being picked off by predators. Being able to blend in with your surroundings is definitely an important direction to go if you are a little hare. Also, look at Mama Lynx. She is just ready. She is crouching. All right, come along, children. All right, all four of you, come on. We'll find you some more food. But all right, so our journey continues. Winter is indeed with us and we are doing our best to try to rustle up whatever food that our lovely Eurasian lynx, aha, there's another bunny, that our lucky Eurasian lynx might be able to find. We just need to sneak around this tree, grab another rabbit, and hopefully I will remember which cubs we already fed so that we can feed the ones who need it. Sneaking up on this one. The winter hunts are so essential. There, there, there. And of course, since this is our first time being a mother, we're learning how to hunt better and better. Like the fact that I just figured out how to make our crouching safer. All right, this one looks like you're a little hungry. Now it's time for you two to be fed. But now I finally figured out how to crouch and to be able to explore just enough. No, no, no. Let the babies eat. Just enough to be able to hunt down those lagomorphs, those rabbits that we're searching for. But it's so quiet here. I wonder if we can find anything else hidden away in this winter world for our little kits to be able to learn from. So let's search along the cliffs. Let's explore along the nooks and crannies. I love the ice. I'm tempted to explore the ice, but there would be nothing there for us. From what I have been reading and researching, lynxes will often hunt moles. They will hunt pheasants. They will definitely, if you are a Canadian lynx, be very, very busy hunting all of the rabbits, but I haven't seen anything about them. Oh, here we go. Oh, come on, come on, come on. Come on. Bunny, 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 pheasant. Woo! But I haven't seen anything about them hunting fish, so I don't think fish would be on the menu for our lynx family. All right, I'm pretty sure you guys got fed last time, so it's like your turn. The different lynx cubs will actually meow louder when they're hungry. And that's one of the things that lynxes will do to vocalize in order to talk to one another. But let's find that pheasant and I'll tell you guys something very cute and fun I learned about lynxes and how they will talk to prey that escapes them in a very special chirping angry voice. So lynxes have been documented making a very sharp trilling almost scolding chirp to prey that happens to get away 
that seems to be an expression of frustration, which I think is extremely cute. All right, good. All four of you are still with us. Aha. There's that pheasant. Oh, there's a whole bunch of pheasants right over here. And a rabbit. Let's go ahead and see what we can rustle up. I wonder if the mama lynx blends in at all with her environment. Whoops. Oh, what? Nature changes, time passes, strength, strength grows, and bone stretches. Living is hard. Oh, I was just about to hunt a pheasant for us, my loves. But I think the time is passing. The seasons are shifting, and we may have done a good job of keeping our babies alive for a whole year, which would be wonderful. Oh! <gasps> Look at them! Oh, I'm so proud! Look at our wonderful little lynxes! They're no longer tiny little cubs, they are now big! They're juveniles, they're going to start learning. Look, 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 we crouch, and now they crouch. Oh, now we have to teach them the ways of how to hunt. This is so exciting, and the seasons have totally shifted. I think we should try to explore a new area. Alright, hang in there, you four. Don't give the game away to the prey. Oh my gosh, was that the pheasant noises? Because that was amazing. Ah, oh, it ran through a tree and I lost it. Fooey. All right, that's why you have to be careful, you four. But all right, look at this. This is so cool. They're now juveniles. And now we're hopefully going to be able to teach them how to do hunting on their own. And I think we can actually start being a little bit more dramatic in where we explore and what we find. And hopefully they can keep up. Oh, there's some food over here. All right, is it a bunny? It is indeed a group of rabbits. Come on, come on, come on. There we go. All right, one, two, three. I'm missing one of my kids already. All right, already missing one. I feel like the little white one is really struggling all of the time. She's a bit dramatic. Hang in there, hang in there. Hang in there, I'm coming, I'm coming. She is a little bit dramatic. I feel like she struggles some, like the most to be able to really sustain herself and stay alive and healthy. So hopefully we'll be able to keep our little winter, winter kit going. And I think they all need their own rabbits now in order to keep moving oh dear the appetites have definitely grown all right let's start doing some exploring if they're fussing as soon as they're meowing i think we need to feed them and now that they're bigger i think their appetites have grown and that is what it means by life is hard just because we've gotten them past the first hurdle doesn't mean we'll be able to get them past the others Especially if the ecosystem is not balanced and if there is not enough prey for us to eat. And the prey does actually shift with each season. So we might want to go ahead and shift by going to a new place, a new area that might offer us up more food. So I'm hoping if we continue going this way, maybe around the lake, we'll find more food resources. I would love to find more collectibles so that we can try to teach our cubs a little bit about the layout of the land. All right, hang on. Your mom needs to go ahead and find food for herself at some point, too. Oh, there's a feather on the ground over here. Oh my gosh, everybody's so hungry. All right, we might have to we might have to like move along and try to find food in a different place. Oh, there we go. All right, Mama Lynx is very tired, but I think there are some bunnies over here. I wonder, I think as time goes on and we show them how to do the hunting, because now it's not only the basics of survival. Whoa, I think some plants just popped up right under our feet. Now it's not only the basics of just keeping them fed that we need to do in order to help them with survival. 
It's teaching them how to... Oh, I think those bunnies disappeared on us. Fooey. Oh, no, there. Gotta get it, gotta get it, gotta get it. I've got babies to feed. All right. Um, I think... Oh, good. Two of them will eat the same bunny. Oh, I was so worried for a second there. That means I really need to feed the gray one. <laughs> Whose names... I love how I spent so long trying to pick perfect names for them. I know, I know, I need to feed you next, my dear. I spent so long trying to pick perfect names for them, and then I just cannot even remember what I named my own children. Life is hard. Alright. Are, are all of them still with us? Yes. Uh-oh, uh-oh, we've had a collapse. Oh no, okay, okay. Where can I find more food? Is this the end of this route? Have I come up? I think I've come up against the back of where we can go. I know, I know, I need to feed you. I need to feed you. Oh, geez. Okay, life is hard. Life is hard. And I need to find more food. All right. I think we need to migrate. I think there's just not enough prey left in this area. So I can't find anything else. I've got to find something in order to get my kids with, uh, with us. Oh no, now another one has collapsed. Oh jeez. Oh jeez, oh jeez, oh jeez. Okay, I stumbled on the leaf. That's great, except I really need more food. Oh, this is not good. Should I have worked on moving out of this area? As soon as the season changed? Is there just not enough food? I can't believe... Maybe the, the rabbits just are not enough plenty. I need to be constantly killing and hunting. I wonder how many how many bunnies and things I need to be hunting a day in order to take care of my babies and there's not enough prey in this area whatsoever in order to feed them I've got to find something to take back like now why can't I find oh thank goodness oh my gosh good job good job one of them hunted one of the others all right, come on. We've got to get back to your siblings, like now. I'm coming, you two. Oh, I can't even run. Oh, geez, this sucks. All right, all right. We've got to get back to both of them. I'm going, I'm going, I'm going. The first one that collapsed. Oh, geez. I'm coming. Oh no. We lost a baby. No, we lost the little gray one because I couldn't get back in time ever since they were small. Truly? Oh, ever since they were small and I just couldn't get back here in time. Oh, Mama, I'm so sorry. Oh. Did you eat? Why do I only have two here? Oh, I need to feed my babies. All right, now we've got these two with us, but we lost our little gray one, didn't we? All right, friends. This is why we need to get a move on and we need to find other territories because I do believe we only have these three left because we couldn't find enough food. Ah. Oh, no, you don't. Oh, no, you don't. If it's your life or the life of my cubs, you're about to be sorely surprised, all of you. Dang it, dang it, dang it. No, right there, right there, right there. Oh, the pheasant can fly, ah. One, two. Oh, I'm so proud of you. I'm so proud of you. You've done a great thing. Bringing food back for your siblings. Oh, wait, 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 why did your sibling just collapse? 
Oh jeez. We need more food and I think a flood is actually coming. Okay. All right. All right, I think there's a huge flood coming, which is not good. No! Okay, okay, okay. I'm going to try to find you some food. I know I chased off the pheasant. Oh my gosh, you guys. And I think something very big and bad and dark is about to happen. If I don't find something to eat somewhere around here and actually being this close to Oh, the river might flood. I didn't think this through. I can't see anything. It's getting very dark. Why is it getting so dark? Why can't I find any food? We've got to get out of here. There's just not enough prey in the area. Oh geez, and my babies are collapsing left, right, and center. Okay, we've got to, we've got to figure out how to get out of here. There just is not enough of anything. Come on, Mama Lynx. Maybe this is going to be a little harder than I thought. Oh geez. <gasps> the flood! The flood! The flood! The flood! The flood! Oh, there's a flood. Oh, there's a flood. Oh, there's fog. Oh, child of mine. What was that? That- that could not have been good. I think we lost another- another child. We need food. This is not good. Oh, how could this get so difficult so fast? Why can't we find anything? Oh, there, 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 there. Okay. Oh, please tell me I didn't just scare it away. Oh, the life of a mother lynx is extremely hard. <laughs> 